Welcome to Show Up and Glow. My name is Jalen. This is my cozy corner, a space created just for you to tune in and chill out. If this interests you, I invite you to find some headphones, quiet space, and join me for a calming and comforting experience. If this is not for you, that is okay. I appreciate you stopping by. As you notice yourself enjoying your stay, please make sure to like and subscribe for more of this calm and cozy vibe. Now let's get started. Welcome to the Cozy Corner. I want to re-welcome you to the Cozy Corner. And uh, if this is your first time here, welcome. It's been a while since we've looked around the space and just kind of got cozy with each other in the present moment of my little, my little nook. So if you're new here, I'm Jalen. And I'm really excited to have you today because I don't feel like we relax and calm down enough in our everyday lives. And I personally don't feel like there are enough outlets for us to do that, especially from the privacy of our own home. Now you may think, well, how is this any different than if I could just sit in my house quietly and not watch something? Isn't that the truest form of solitude and cozy? And I would have to say, yes, that is. cozy corner and my favorite way to calm down personally is to watch Bob Ross Bob Ross the OG ASMR artist with his lovely paint sounds beating the devil out of his paint brushes on the bottom of his easel his voice and just 30 solid minutes of watching him create art. I mean, it just puts you in a zone. So I wanted to create the Cozy Corner to help do that to you. So in the Cozy Corner, we have my lovely bookshelf. Yes, I have read some of these books and no, I have not read some of these books, but I love books. I love going to the bookstore. I love collecting books, I love smelling books, I love reading books, I love looking for new books. What about you? And if you are also a book lover, I would love to know in the comments below what kind of books you personally look for. Right now your girl's working with a lot of cookbooks, I've got a lot of cookbooks in my collection. Obviously, a lot of cozy books, books on yoga, books on cozy lifestyle like Huga, um, The Danish Way of Living and Slowing Down. I also have some fiction books. I have a couple fiction authors I love. That's kind of what I'm working with right now. But yeah, see if uh, you notice any books on my shelf that maybe you have too. I would love to know if we have similar styles. Over my shoulder we have lovely lady. Lovely lady. And she is my best friend. I'm just kidding. Um, she is she is what keeps this cozy atmosphere on track. She is the cozy bubbling and moving and calming you down. 
off your eyes and to dart around the room for a moment and find something else to relax you, come on back to lovely Lady Lava Lamp. She's fantastic. And which brings me to her counterpart, because we can't have one without the other. This guy. This guy. Mr. Clock is our constant pace for the show. Just one of the also OG sounds we have all heard growing up that can soothe you or not. Some people have different reactions to Mr. Clock. Most of the reactions are good. I love him as well. I, he brings me a lot of comfort. But that's the cozy corner. And uh, sometimes we, we get silly in the cozy corner. Sometimes we calm down with deep calm down sessions or deep relaxation sessions. Sometimes we're chatty and sometimes we're quiet. So, if you're a regular and you're a subscriber, thank you so much for being here again today. I know you know my Cozy Corner very well, and I appreciate all your support. And if you're new here, well, we're going to do some... Oh, see? That marks the top of the hour, and then Toto should be barking at us. But we're not going to do that, like I was saying. If you're new here, I want to take it back a little bit with uh, some... OG videos of my own, which we used to do a lot of, and I think it's really helpful to calm your mind, calm your body, calm the day, whatever time of day you're watching this. So we're going to do a couple rounds of breath, and we're going to do some light stretching. That's all we're going to do. You can be seated in a chair like me, you can be laying down, you can be standing up, whatever, wherever feels comfortable for you today. I just want you to follow along and see how you feel once we do some rounds of breath, some nice gentle stretching, and just being in the cozy corner listening to the music, the sound of my voice, the clock, just being here. That's all I ask, is that you just be present. Okay. So. Let's just listen to a couple sounds before we start breathing to relax all of the mind, all of the face, all of the body. And I, I specifically say all of the face because we are using that throughout the entire day. And boy, does it get tired. So, as you listen to some sounds, why don't you just gently rest your eyes closing them if possible and let's start some rounds of deep breath together so we're going to do some counted breathing and just so you know where we're going with this, we're going to do four rounds. So, when we begin, I want you to inhale for four, hold for seven, and exhale for eight. 
we're going to do four rounds of that. So get into your comfortable position. Meet your breath right now where it is in the neutral form. And on your next inhale, let's inhale for two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, inhale, two, three, four, hold, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and exhale, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Inhale, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And exhale, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Let your breath return back to natural. Gently breathing in and out through the nose. Noticing how different your shoulders feel after taking a handful of breaths together. Noticing how light your head feels clearer after focusing on the breath for four rounds and silencing the mind. And notice how your lungs feel, mindfully breathing into them and exhaling something we don't even notice throughout our day, something we tend to take for granted. It's just so natural, so focusing on it can feel a little bit like self-love noticing this part of your body that works so hard for, for us since the moment you were born. Now that we've focused on the breath, I want us to just gently stretch out parts of our body in this position. Again, if you're lying down, it's totally fine. Um, we're just going to work on the upper body and we're going to do light stretching together. If you're a big stretcher, you're going to love this. If you're not a big stretcher, you're also going to love this because it stretching, our body loves to stretch. It really does. So let's start with the neck. However you are, I just want you to tilt your head to the side, feeling the nice stretch down your neck right here, making the shoulders feel heavy, like gravity is pulling them down to the ground, and just breathe into that stretch in the side of the neck, making sure your jaw is not tight and tensed and clenched. Relax the jaw and relax the tongue. Gently bring the head back up to the center. Notice the difference on both sides. And then gently tilt the head to the opposite side stretching the other side of your neck just breathing into the space and then gently 
gently bringing your head back to center. I feel like we need to tilt our head forward now. The back of my neck is feeling like it needs a little release. So I want you to gently bring your chin down to your chest. Just pause here, breathing into the back of the neck and the top of the shoulders. Saying to yourself and being mindful that the body loves to stretch, that these sensations are healthy for our body they're moving energy, blood, toxins, stretching the muscles that can be stuck in a position for a long time during the day. This is healthy for you and so easy to do any time of the day. Now bring your head back up to center gently, not too fast. I feel a tingling sensation through the neck and the shoulders after stretching just that little bit. How amazing. We're going to do one final one for the arms. So I want you to cross your arm across your body. I like to use my other hand to grab my wrist and gently pull it back towards my chest, stretching my shoulder and the back of the arm. I'm closing the eyes to really feel into the stretch. Gently releasing that arm. Ooh, so nice. And repeating on the opposite side. Gently releasing the other arm. And just sit here for a moment, feeling how different the upper body feels to the lower body. It should feel more like a, an energy circulating from your neck to your fingertips, up and down your arms, up and down your neck and shoulders, just like a coolness And I invite you, as the music plays out, to continue to stretch parts of your body that also feel tight. Maybe you do a little, some twists in your chair or lying down. Maybe you pull the legs, you know, like a figure four where you pull one leg back with the assistance of the other leg. Maybe you do some calf stretches, some hip stretches. Whatever you think your body would feel best doing listening to the cues your body's telling you the parts it wants to release i hope you feel much more relaxed and i'm really grateful that you joined me in the cozy corner today because you can be anywhere on youtube and you might go somewhere else after this and that's totally fine it's a free market we can do whatever we want but I really appreciate you being here with me today. So I'll see you again real soon.